Hello favorites, welcome back to Favorites with Laura. Today I have a um, Timu Hall sponsored uh, collaboration um, through their influencer program. And so today's campaign and what I chose had to do with essential nail uh, supplies. And so we all love to do our nails and I love doing DIY nails. I have a lot of different ways that I do them. Right now I don't have anything on because I do want to come back at some point and show you how I use some of these items. And they had a lot to select from, let me tell you. Um, today's outfit of the day, if you care. Um, I just thought it's fun. Is This is one of those free uh, choices I had with an order one time um, from Timu. And it's, it's, you know, it's just a little cheesy thing, but I like how long it is and how it hangs and looks on this, especially on this Timu sweater that I had um, that I paid for. Um, and then these earrings are from a couple years ago from, I think, Maurice's. So anyway, that's that's the look today. I have a lot coming. So please, if you haven't subscribed, um, think about it. Hit the subscribe button. Hit the little bell that um, will notify you for all videos and alerts from my channel so that when I put things up that are new, that are of interest to you, um, you're going to be uh, not miss out. You're not going to miss out. Nobody wants to have that FOMO and, and fear of missing out of anything. So I know I have that. So Let's get started, okay? So the first thing is, here is the bag. Small but mighty. And um, I, I don't know, you know, I had picked out so many things and they're like, um, even though I had the seating money, they were like, that's too many items. You gotta keep it to under 15 items. So I think I did. I'm gonna try to do this in the order that I have set up. And so I'm gonna just dump it out here, okay? Because it'll be easier for me to find. Now, all the links will be below. And if you don't know about Timu, I, I, I really don't know. I'm going to try to help you. But if you don't know about Timu, Timu is an online marketplace. They work with many, many different suppliers, much like some of the other sites that you shop from. And they've cut out the middleman so that you can get the same items or very similar items that you would purchase elsewhere at a much lower cost. They offer free shipping. They have great customer service. And I have, I've utilized their customer service to maybe every level and degree you could think of. And they have been so helpful, very responsive. Sometimes it does take a little bit, but I do a lot of live chats with them on online. And I seem to get good responses that way. Um, with the uh, influencer program, there is a contact that you're connected with and that's who I go to every time I have a question. So links are below. Prices can change but I'm going to give you the current price as if as of yesterday. So that would have been September 1st. So I'm recording this. You're going to see a lot of videos maybe in the similar. I'm going to try to change it out. Um, it helps me to identify my videos too. So I know I know how you are. That's how I am. So let's let's try to um, help each other out and with that, I purchased, it's a five-in-one nail art dotting tool. Now this I thought was pretty cool because um, pen, fountain, pit, uh, let's see, painting, drawing, carving. So you can use it for different things. It was $177. Now if you have never ordered before from Timu, you can go to my link below. You can download the app and you're going to save 50% with my code, which is FAV70814. And that code is good for um, for any of your orders, but when you download that app the first time, you're going to want to make decisions. So know what you want to buy. Take a look at the site on, on the web prior to downloading because you have a limited time to utilize that 50% off. So I don't want you to lose out on that. Now, this is the tool right here. And it is very pretty. We're going to open this up comes in a container and it's a special like dotting like you could use this for painting but I bought it for nail art so I do all kinds of things with stickers stamps as you've seen in mon some of my other videos and I've never seen a dotting tool like this I've seen like you know they're all fixed tips to them the ones I've seen and have this one is not fixed tip you can change it out I believe that's what we're going to look at here Oh yeah, it has pieces in here. And look at the sparkle. And it's pink. 
I'm hoping you can see that okay. All right. So it has like little tiny sparkly things in there. Okay, so it's a very sharp tool too. Well, no, it's it's got the, the ball point to it right there. And looks like that might be, okay, so this might be the, keeping it real. <laughs> okay, let me find out. And they look like they might be magnetically uh, connected to the tip. So there's those five right there. You can see all the different sizes. Um, even if you're a painter, this would be great. So let's see. Oh, okay, okay. Looks like it goes like that. Okay, so this piece comes out. So it's really six. Does it say that? Five plus one? Five and one nail. Okay, so you have that tip. Then you could put this tip in. It's got like a silicone O-ring in there and then it fits very tightly in there. And then you would just attach that. What a beautiful tool. Okay, so, and then it holds everything else in here, except for that big wide tip that um, it was attached to first. So I'm going to put that back together the way it is, um, unless it does fit in there. I don't want to damage that tool. Okay, so let's, let's see how easy this is to come out. Uh, I have lotion on my hands, so I had to put the smallest tip in. So we got that out, okay? So we're gonna put that back in here, like that. We're gonna put this back in like that. And we're gonna put this tip back in. Put that in. Oh, I see, there's little grooves in there too. I'll put it in my little holder here. Excuse me while I organize a little bit. Okay, so the next item, up is a hundred piece clear nail swatch stick. Okay, so I bought these a long time ago. One of my earlier orders for nail products, I never hauled it. Um, I was early on and I I just didn't do it. I should have, but they work great. So I did order some more. What are these you say? So if you're new to doing a lot of nails at home, these are little swatch kits. So I got a hundred pieces because I bought 50 before and with all the different nail colors, I don't have it. So what you do here, and they come with a ring, so you can put them on the ring, and I'll just pull out a couple. So the way I like to do these, so they all look like, they just look like a nail. Now they come in white and the clear. I like the clear myself, but you know, everybody has a preference. These were $3.97 for 100 of them, and you get two rings. To, to put them on. So I always paint the underneath side because I know I'm always gonna, I don't like matte. If I do matte, it's gonna be like an, as an accent on the nail. I like the gloss, the high gloss myself, but you never know, people change. I change my mind, so don't hold me to that. Um, but you paint underneath this and then you write in a Sharpie or you can create labels and, and identify the brand and the number or the color if it has a name to it. And that's so easy when you're trying to figure out what nail color to go instead of looking through um, a, a tote with all your nail polishes in it. This is a great tool. Highly recommend those and getting a hundred of them for $3.97. What a bargain, right? Okay, so then I did get this. Now, I have LED UV lighter uh, lights, you know, to cure your gel nails, which I love. Um, but they have to be plugged in. They are USB, but they still need to be plugged in. And I was looking for something a little bit more that hold. Now I have the little one that you can use. That's just for, you hold it and it's one finger and it's a battery run one, but I wanted something that I could use at least three or four fingers in. And so this was a USB rechargeable LED nail dryer and it's fast and efficient gel nail polish curing light for fingernails and toenails, 198. So it does come with your little USB charging cord, comes in this box. And as you can see, this box is just beautifully kept in transit um, in colors. And I think the pink was sold out when I was choosing this, so I got white. And anyway, so you can see, nothing's changed with Timu. The boxes are still smashed when you get them. They still are economizing when they do shipping. It is free shipping, so 
I, I'm not too upset about that. So here is the little lamp and it has, it looks like six lights. So it's not for like a big time and then it has little legs that pop out here. There you go. Now, if this doesn't work out of the box, it'll be the first time I've ordered, maybe the second time. Um, it's called Sun Mini UV Light. It'll be one of the second times I've ordered something that wasn't charge of, charged at least to try it. So let's, let's go. Oh, Timu. Oh, Timu. It's not charged. <laughs> Usually it has a little juice just so you can see what it looks like. So what we're going to do while I move on to the next items is I have a big tower here that has USB and USC outlets along with the standard outlets so it can economize. Economize? No. It can accommodate my videos and viewers so we can get to the truth of the matter on these items quickly. Okay, so I'm going to plug that in. Uh-oh, I'm going to have to unplug. Oh no, there we go. So we'll let that charge a second. If this has to be plugged in, I'm not going to be very happy. So it's plugged in. It's working right now. We're going to let it have some juice and then I'm going to unplug it because it says rechargeable, everybody. So that's what we want. Next up, these are 24 white French tip press on toenails. <laughs> have you ever done that? I've done it, especially when I'm going to the beach and I'm in a rush and I've never had time to do my nails or get them done. So they make press on nails for your toes. Yes, they do. And I have a little pinky toe and I'm sure many of you do. Um, that doesn't have much nail to it. So I bought these pretty little things. <laughs> 179 oh that rechargeable nail UV light is 198 I might have been looking at the wrong thing but you're gonna see everything below so look how pretty these are with the little rhinestones at the base and they come you get um, 24 pieces delicate and comfortable okay Jimu will be the judge if they're comfortable and you have all the little tiny baby ones right there for your baby toes yeah so that's fun when you're in a rush. Oh, and it comes with a file. Okay, so oh, it looks like it had a cuticle. Boy, I'm just dropping. Oh, and it has the little sticky pads. <laughs> I'm dropping everything out of this box. So that's cool. It has the little sticky pads. Of course, you could glue them on too. And I think for my toes, I might actually glue them on. So I don't have to worry about my darn toes being camera ready. <laughs> like I ever show my toes. I'm not doing that. Okay, so this one here, this is called Long Lasting Starry Night. I think this one is currently sold out. This is gel polish. I think this is it. It comes in that box. Now that box, I guess it, because it is smaller, came out really nice. I mean, no damage if you were going to give this to somebody. Red Starry Night Nail Nude. It's not nude, um, but they have so many different colors. And I like the bottle and I wanted to see how opaque it was and let's take a look at this color Ooh, that is a pretty color now here it's like kind of like a red orange so perfect for fall would look great with this outfit and I just this bottle is heavy um, it gives like weight to it and quality so if you were gonna get some colors and put it into like a little gift bag with nail stuff this would be a great little product um, I don't have the price because it is sold out and all the colors are sold out on this one so that's too bad um, but if you go to the link I did put the link below um, you can get and click notify once you go to more details so it'll say sold out you go up to the top click more details it's kind of a fine print there but it does have an arrow it will bring you in and hopefully you can hit the notify you um, when it comes back into stock so um, I don't have the price on what that one was, but totally very nice quality it looks like. And we'll know more when I paint on it. Um, then I did get 20, 240 piece soft gel nail tips. These were 269 size 12 um, half matte clear. Um, 
So I got the matte, it looks like, and the clear, or are they all clear? Oh, they're all matte and clear. Okay, so I didn't really care about that part because I'm using them strictly to attach to my nail, and I'm going to decorate them whatever way I want. But I like that they're already short, so there won't be much prep work. Um, how many sizes did it say? Size 12. Okay. So, and they're the short ballet fake nail tips. Okay. So let's take one out and see how this is. I like that it comes in the case and they're all situated based on size. Oh yeah. Okay. So that'll probably go right there. Oh, these are going to be perfect length for me. Oh yeah. Okay. So that, let's see if I can get that. That is the perfect length. I mean, it even gives me a little room to um, maybe file a little bit more and shape it more, but I love this length. It won't take as long to get it ready. I love it. I, I mean, this is the best one. If you like short nails and you don't want to have to do much, so here's what I'm going to do with this, and it's going to be a little bit out of order. Okay. Magnetic nail stand. So, and it comes with the little sticky pads, 314. So... What I plan to do now is to make up my nails ahead of time. <laughs> of course, I always change my mind. I always see new designs, and I'm probably, like, the last set of nails I had on, oh, my gosh. I used that glue from Timu, um, one set, and I always put it on the nail and then on the little uh, tip that I'm going to put on. So they have both have nail, and then I hold it, and I had to wait forever for those nails to come off. I was shocked, shocked I tell you. So this little kit comes like this. It has these little sticky. Now this is um, reusable. They're not like the sticky pads. It's like re reusable, what is it called? Putty, the putty. So I've never used the putty before. Um, but it's not for your nails. It's to go on these little magnetic nail tip holders. So what you do here is you take this, you have this bar you have this bar, so I would put this here. It sticks like a magnet. Take some putty, put it here, and put a little nail tip. Once I measure out which nail tips I'm going to put on which fingers, I would line it up here. Have you ever seen these? So I, I just see. I just saw them for the first time this year. Um, never used these um, before earlier this year, and they work great. Um, if you look at some of the nail tutorials out there on the internet, you're going to see a lot of them using these. And so they set up their nails, decorate their nails, do everything to their nails, and use a little putty here, put your tips in the order, and then you can sit there and hold it like this and just paint it. So much easier, everybody. Oh my gosh. So I wanted to show you that. It's a little bit out of order of how it's going to be displayed in my description box below, but I'll just show you this again. It comes like this. magnetic so you can keep these and then you would just pop off your nails put them in a little ziplock label them whatever you want and then you're going to have them like press on nails ready to go make your own so that's what i'm doing later on today when i'm done with this I'll go from there okay so the next thing i got are these little maple leaf uh sequence laser leaf sequence nail decorations they were 37 cents they had all different ones too. Um, also, this comes in different colors for your your preference. But yes, how many did I get in here? Oh, oh, it doesn't tell me. Okay, let's go to the link, everybody. Okay, so here, look how pretty those are. So I wouldn't put a lot, but I would like I can make it a little design, put a stamp on there, maybe a little, all kinds of things, outline them, rhinestones, whatever. So these come. Doesn't really tell you how many you're gonna get in here, but really, you're gonna get plenty. I mean, there's gotta be at least 100 in there or something. Uh, yeah, I don't see where it tells me how many. So you can get all different ones. Right now they have silver maple leaves, gold maple leaves, green, blue, iridescent, different colors. Just so many, purples, pinks, yeah, so. That is really cool. 37 cents. They're all 37 cents right now, too. Uh-oh. 
But, oh, something looks like it leaked. Now, I've seen this happen to other people. The good thing is they have been really, really good about stuff like this. So I will reach out to my contact if, indeed, that is a problem. Okay, so I'm not... Okay, yes. Oh, my gosh. Okay. <sighs> so... Okay, this is a nail stomp stamper, so it's the jelly stamper with UV light, French tip nail stamper. So you can do all kinds of things, not just French tips. And it's a stamping manicure tool, $3.98. So here it is. I think it did come in different colors, but of course I got the silver this time. It has a cover on the jelly side, so you pull that off and you can see it's a jelly. Okay. Um, probably takes batteries. Let's see. And it does. It takes one, two, three AAA batteries, which I do have. Um, but I don't want to keep you here too long. Um, so we will get that working, I'm sure. And so here's the cool thing about this. I use regular... I use both. I've used gel polishes as well as the regular standard polishes that don't require a UV light and the stamping plates and you swatch, swatch your uh, colors across the plates and the image on here. So what's awesome about this is now, there was a noise over there, maybe my neighbors, is it also has the UV light. So you stamp it and then you can, you'll have your UV light right there because sometimes you're just stamping um, a small section and this tool is going to be awesome. This is awesome. Awesome. I didn't realize what they were saying when I picked it and I'm so happy I have this. I will be using this a lot. So let's see. Does this part come off too? Sorry about that noise. Okay. So yes, it does not. That's awesome. Okay. 398 right now, currently as of last night. Then I did pick up one of these, even though I use alcohol for gel polishes, I use alcohol to wipe away. You don't put anything on your stamper, your rubber jelly stamper. You always use um, a lint roller. I think I misspoke in another video, but you want to use a lint roller like the tape, and that will pick up everything and get your stamper clean. If it's still not coming up, you just wash it with a little uh, warm water and soap, and you're going to be good to go. Let that dry, and you'll be fine. Don't ever use any um, chemicals on there, no acetone, no... I, I was using alcohol, but you know what? It does cloud it still a little bit, so don't do that. Don't do, don't do what I've done. Um, this is a nail polish remover, so when you have just a little bit to pick up, um, it's supposed to have the right... So that has a fatter tip right there, and I'm betting you're going to have to um, push down to get it to, to go. Oh, look at that! So it comes with three different tips, three three extra tips. So you're not gonna run out. Okay, especially if you're picking up a red, it usually stains those tips. Now, I think what you do here is you have to, um, like you dip it in your nail polish uh, remover and then swipe or your alcohol and then just go around. That's, let's see, does it? Yes, you, you uh, it will hold a lot of acetone. So somewhere here, we're gonna put acetone in here. Oh, so it has like a little sponge in there. I'm glad we looked it up. It has like a little sponge in there, so you would just drip a little bit if you have a funnel, or um, put a little bit of acetone in there. Maybe you just soak it in there. It's gonna hold, somebody said it holds a lot of acetone, so that must be why I picked that. So there, there you go. Then we're going to look at this glitter foil jelly gel glitter sequence nail polish. Hmm. Oh, it's right here. Okay. This was 148. It's a gel nail polish. I picked out this is what I was talking about earlier where it has a um, glitter effect to it, and I just wanted a little bit. No, apparently it's not. <laughs> What is this, you guys? Let's see what we're supposed to... My leg's going to sleep. Because I'm too short and my leg um, hits it right at the wrong angle. That is this one. Now, what color did I get? Looks like I got... 
DC 94. Oh, DC 94. DC 94 is the amber gold. Okay, so that's what we got. And it, it does have a little shimmer to it. Okay, so I don't, well, I have a UV light there right now. Let's just swatch a little bit. Oh, it is pretty. It has, it's a little bit, it's not as opaque, but it's not as sheer as some of the other ones I have. And it has just a tiny, tiny little bit of sparkle to it. I think I have a napkin over there I can use to, to wipe that off. Can you see it? That is a pretty, pretty color. Oh my gosh. What nail design am I gonna do? I'm happy with this. This is a beautiful, beautiful color. Sorry, I picked the, probably the most awkward finger to get. <laughs> and I didn't do all the way to the tip, but just to kind of swatch it for you. It goes deep. It looks like you're looking in the stars in the sky. I bet a blue would look really pretty, a navy blue. I guess I'll have another update on my community post for this item too. Um, that's where I'm gonna put updates from now on and I can add pictures. I think I can do a little video, maybe not. No, it's just pictures and text on the community post. So that's why you wanna be um, subscribed and click the bell so you know when I do give updated information. This is gorgeous. I can stare at it all day. I won't. Let's get moving. Okay, so the next thing is a brush set. So this is a seven-piece professional UV gel nail brush set. It's currently sold out. Let's see. That was last night. Um, I'll show you this while this link opens. This is what it looks like. It has all different tips and sizes, so you can use these for... If they're stiff enough, you'll want to use them for um, all kinds of uh, product that you put on your nails. Currently sold out, not discontinued. That's always a good thing. Super, super pretty. And when it's sold out, it doesn't tell me the price anymore. So these are all like acrylic handles with the silver. And if I remember, they had different options to choose from. Look how pretty those are. Okay, these... Oh, I just... <laughs> I forgot I didn't set that nail polish. Good Lord. Okay, I'm gonna have to like wipe that off and then continue. Um, these are not the real tiny ones. They're more like for putting on poly gels or acrylics and things like that. Next item we have here. These are 288 pieces of matte pure color press on nails, full coverage, frosted false nails. They are 404 for 288. Now, I thought, what a quick and easy way to have a base. Now, you know with stamping art and different kinds of nail art you can do, it'd be nice to just have a base. Now, I can tell that I will have to file some of the edges, but here's what it looks like. Lots of variety here, and I would definitely have their mats, so um, you do have to probably... You can wear them just like this, but see how this has a tip to it? I don't know if you can tell, but there's a little raw edge to that. So you just have to file that a little bit. with it. I use an 8080. Um, oh my gosh, these are the perfect, perfect sizes. And they have, everyone has multiple sizes in each color. But look how short that is. I love it. I know some people want long nails. I need, I want some stylish nails, but I need them short for typing. So, and on the keyboard. I guess that's what they call it, keyboarding now. Um, and once again, we see my old wrinkly hands. Urgh. So you have that color. Look at all these pretty colors. Man. And then you can also buy the nail um, sticky pads if you just want to put them on temporary or use your regular nail glue, whatever you use normally. Now, this is a top and a base coat, and it's a little sticky on the outside. So maybe it was in a box, but I think it's all on the inside here of this baggie. I'm going to have to come back because I don't want to open it here on this table. I'll be back after I see what's going on. So... Good thing and good news and bad news. The that was a set that was a base coat, 
and a top coat. Um, the base coat had opened up and um, spilled into the bottle. It wasn't closed all the way. I guess it didn't open up. It was opened. And that was a $5.97 for the two pack, the base and the top. The good news is the top coat is intact, not open, not spilled. And in all honesty, um, I really wanted the top coat. So this is soak off gel and it's on there tight. So I feel good about this. And yeah, I love top coats. Anyway, so let's move on. Um, that's supposed to be high shine. So that's what I wanted, especially with the matte. These, I thought that would be great. Um, then I got, looks like I must have passed it. So that might be a little bit out of order. That's the brush set. That's that. This is a six piece set of gel polishes. Um, red, white, blue, pop colors, and autumn semi permanent soak off UV LED nail art. Gel glitter nail polish. <laughs> they keep repeating themselves in the description. So this set was $11.48 as of last night. And this is the last item. So I got six pieces. It came, it came like this. And at first I thought maybe one of these had opened up, but they had not. And they're all individually packaged like this. And they do have the numbers on the top, so I do like that. So when I swatch them on my swatch uh, ring nails, um, I will probably put, you know, part part of the name so I can identify them quickly. Um, of course, I wouldn't have room to write all of that. This is 27. I would write 27 on here. And this color, so it comes in a bottle like this. They're not huge, but it doesn't take a lot, hopefully. Uh, oh, that's pretty. Yes, so I'm going to, you know, I do put up the little screenshot of what it was like on the it's sticky too so that's good so that I like that so I got all the fall colors you're gonna see a picture up or here or here or there I don't know um, I feel like I'm getting my groove back I was kind of really I don't know I don't know what was going on but I feel better and it's you know there's a lot of good stuff going on there's always going to be the noise and the sounds of the world and different events happening, but um, maybe it was pulling on me. I don't know, but I felt really like kind of run down and I feel a lot better today. So uh, thank you. Thank you all for supporting this channel. Thank you for helping us grow. I appreciate each and every one of you. And that's my Timu haul that's sponsored today. Um, anytime you like, interact with us, Anytime you can do that, I welcome your comments. I will reply. I will reply as quickly as possible. And if you want to share it, if you want to subscribe, that all helps to grow this channel, helps to grow my um, seating balance with Timu so that I can, again, pick out some things. Um, I do have some shoes coming that I purchased. So not sandals now. This, these will be the first set of shoe shoes that I've bought. I guess I have had some slip-on tennis shoes. But uh, these are going to be more dressy for work, and I'm looking forward to sharing those with you. So, again, remember to hit subscribe if you haven't. Thank you if you have, and I wish, I wish you all a great day. Thank you. Bye.